I'm tired of taking hits for other people's decisions, so I'm about to just say my side of the story. Only the things that have to do with me, nothing else, because at the end of the day, this is not my business. And as you guys see my post yesterday, I said everybody's grown here. Screenshots were here, so I'm gonna be showing y'all like this. So if I'm looking down, that's why. Me and Trey was vibing and talking after his birthday. To his birthday party, his birthday Airbnb, I stayed there. Me and Angel slept on the couch. I got him a gift. After his birthday, me and him just started talking more frequently. At this point, we was on the phone every day. We was texting every day, all of this other stuff. He flew out to my birthday and that was in October. So he came to my birthday in, in October and Justin, Angel, and Trey was there. These are the only three people that have anything to do with my story. During my birthday, <laughs> Everybody peeped that there was something going on between Je Angel and Trey. Like, they kept ending up by themselves together and, like, you know, a female no. There was also, like, TikToks being filmed and all this other stuff. Mind y'all, like, I'm seeing all of this, but I'm not saying anything to not Angel or not Trey. Fast forward to them leaving together. They left together to the airport. I don't know if this was after their flight or before their flight. Yeah, I see the TikToks. This is them at the airport. After my birthday was when Trey immediately started being weird. He wasn't texting me every day no more. And you know, I was peeping stuff. Me and Justin had a conversation like, do they have something going on? Like, do they have sex? Like, you know, was they vibing? It's been a thought in both me and Justin's head since last year around my birthday because we we people was going on here trey goes to me okay trey stopped talking to me well not stopped talking to me but he didn't even like text me back um once i knew he landed so i texted angel and i said you still with trey as soon as i sent that message trey texted me i said never mind he texted me she said yeah we just got in the car and yes i'm good so that happened around like october 15th me and justin got on the phone and was continuously talking about trey and angel Justin was my best friend at that time, and we was trying to figure out what was going on. You know, I was, I really liked Trey, so I was like, like, should I just cut him off? Justin basically telling me, yeah, just, just cut it off, because you don't know what they got going on. Adi, adi, adi. The next day, I texted Justin. This is me and Justin's messages. I said, I think you was right. He said, about what? I said, Angel and Trey. So that proves to y'all that me and Justin was talking about it. I also texted... Trey and I asked do you F with Angel and he said what you mean he wasn't confirming nor denying what was going on so I cut things off with Trey and I said when I see Angel I'm just gonna ask her myself so fast forward to November then we went to Turkey Leg and at the end of our little dinner or whatever I had asked Angel I'm like did you have something going on with Trey do you and Trey have something going on she said well I asked Trey if he messes with you or he messed with you and he said no. So from that moment forward, I knew that it was gonna be some BS. Anything that come out her mouth was gonna be BS because why are you asking him that? If you physically seen him putting get laying gifts out on my bed, you know, you see me and him, I told you what was going on. So I noted where I stand with Angel and I texted Trey and I told him about himself which i don't even got to insert them their messages after that me and trey did not talk for months y'all months as trey yourself ghosted him i was so mad at trey i was more mad at trey than i was at angel but me and trey did not talk for months in may was when me and trey actually started getting more like i don't want to say serious but like vibing whatever y'all want to call it you know he was really liking me this time <laughs> time and you know I was liking him and he came out with the truth he told me because Trey is really loyal at the end of the day he never lied he never said that they didn't have anything going on he never denied it so he just told me the truth he's like look yeah we laid together yeah me and Angel was talking adi 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 he told me that in May you guys influencer city did not start until June 23rd Okay, don't you guys think if I've been through this information, I would been would have called my best friend, Justin, at the time and told him, didn't do it. 
fast forward to I got the screenshots on my phone that's why I'm scrolling fast forward to influencer city I don't remember the exact date that Justin texted me but he randomly texted me when I knew he was on the tour and he said bestie I said yes he said a bunch of stuff that I'm not even gonna put in there because I'm not I'm not about that's none of my business okay he's gonna start here he said yes in Columbus I told her when I get back to Houston I want to see her I said bestie where was Angel that's the first thing I said Justin called me and basically said that he wanted his out with Angel and was asking me did me and Trey I mean not me and Trey did Angel and Trey do something I said no from what I know Trey told me that they did not do anything the only thing I know is that they laid together Justin basically was like um I didn't know that they laid together Angel didn't tell me that well did you and Trey have sex and I was like me and Trey didn't have sex they had to have sex because you and Trey didn't have sex yet it's been all this time adi 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 Playing in the bed was new to Justin's ears, but I've been new because Trey been told me the truth when me and Trey first started talking back in May. <laughs> okay, like I could only believe with who I with. If Trey told me they didn't have sex, then they didn't have sex. That's what I got. She's like, okay, well if Angel calls you, tell her we didn't speak. Angel calls me, I tell him we didn't speak. He's, she's running me down the whole story. Justin just came in here and said this, 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 this. Adi, adi, adi. Okay. All right. Me and, me and what's name got off the phone. Justin went to Benet and asked Benet, do you know if Trey and, and Jada had sex? I mean, Trey and Angel had sex. I guess Benet said yes. I don't know. I just felt like she was being messy. She got on the Influencer City thing and said that she heard me and Justin on the phone. All this other stuff. Cap. Justin and Benet had a conversation. Justin told Benet that we got on the phone. So I unfollowed Benet. These are messages of Justin saying, did you hear what she said? I said, who, Benet? He said, yes. I said, oh, yeah. Angel sent the video to me. She told me that, that they used to troll Angel. She's weird and break us up, whatever. I said, Benet is messy for that. And I unfollowed Benet. Trey told me they didn't have sex. Y'all, they didn't have sex. I believe it. I believe Trey. They didn't have sex. That's not true. That was an accusation made up, and it wasn't a rumor made up for me. The last thing I want to clear up is Angel said that she ended up getting with Trey or talking to Trey or whatever the case may be because I said that me and her wasn't friends in a YouTube video at Lena's house. Me and Angel did spend a lot of time together. Spent nights at her house. She was with me the whole time at Trey's birthday. And I invited her to my birthday. I would never invite nobody to my birthday. It's not my friend. Me and Angel was close. She knew it was up with me and Trey. I told her that I liked Trey. And the next thing I wanted to clear up was that I was being messy because I was putting both of my friends on with Justin. I was not putting both of my friends on with Justin. Justin was telling me I want both of them. I was telling them Justin is a hoe. He's going to be a man. And he's going to do what he wants to do. This nigga asking me which one's gonna let me fuck first. I'm like, Justin, I don't know. I know Lena like that. I just met Angel. I do not know. I don't know. So that's just that. Last time speaking on a situation, I'm on such a different point in my life. Like I'm on such a happy, peaceful side of my life. Y'all know I just turned 20. I'm on a new phase of my life. I'm not into none of this drama stuff. Y'all can leave my name out of this. I don't want nothing to do with this. I'm not speaking on it anymore. I don't care what you guys say. I know the plans that God has for me. And I'm not letting nothing or nobody get in the way of that. And that's all I have to say. Be blessed. <laughs>